Alright, what's going on guys? My name is Dick here. I'm gonna be doing the uh, Jackal Jeep Jack Off Challenge. Another community challenge um, uh, from Emmett to Spain. Who, um, the last challenge I did on playing the Dick uh, was a response to the uh, Batman Fist of Fury challenge. It was. Which was a great challenge because I uh, had not given Batman some love in a while. But uh, this is the Jack Old Jeep Jack Off Challenge. Which is a great name for a challenge. I couldn't have come up with a better name for a challenge myself there. Emmett, so props for that! Uh, the rules here are uh, play Jack Old pretty normally, but you cannot use your uh, missile weapons for uh, average sort of stuff. If you want to save dudes, you can uh, shoot the things, and there's certain walls you can jump and shoot, and there's uh, some bosses you have to use for it, but as far as like normal sort of gameplay, um, don't use your uh, sub-weapon there. And no continues. Ugh, excuse me. But uh, I will not be uh, saving anybody. Anybody, fuck them. I am footballing this bitch. So, footballing this bitch. Um, I did play this game a little earlier uh, in the background during a Skype conversation I was having earlier with uh, some of my bros and hoes uh, who were also male. And uh, just to get reacquainted with it, because I have not played Jacko in Jacko. Jacko in forever. Which is a uh, shame, really, because Jacko's a freaking great game. Um, uh, so it's great to give Jackal some fucking love. Uh, Jackal's a game I don't think I've ever freaking beaten, which is uh, kind of a shame, really. Um, I've played it a lot, though. I've played it. Uh, it's a great pick up and play, kill 15 minutes game. So I've played it a lot uh, through the years, uh, usually in co-op, because it's got a great co-op thing going on. But yeah, never really just whatever. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna be footballing this bitch, so. Um, which can be a bad thing, I suppose. You can get extra lives um, by saving people and all that stuff. I'm not really sure um, if it's one of those games where you get extra lives at a certain point threshold and then rest of the lives come at higher point thresholds. I don't know if that's a thing. Some games are like that. But, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna football this bitch. Which is something I kind of like to do in some of these, uh, top-down style shooters. You know. Oh, shit, that guy's coming after me. That guy's fucking after me. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I really should have just... Ignore all that, but uh, again, this game's sort of a shmup. So uh, I find shmups kind of hard to uh, commentate over, as you can really lose your uh, something can happen, and then you're like, oh shit. Okay, I fucked that up. Okay, screw that up. Okay. Props to Jackal for having missiles that don't totally look like fucking dicks. Props to Jackal for that. Because I played so many S games in my day. Them motherfuckers were dicks. Without a doubt. Alright, I am, uh. Oops. This is not going. I'm definitely on the defense here. Defense. Killing these, uh, I don't know what they are. Aphrodite looking mofos, I guess. Alright, whew. Alright, so I died. That sucks, but whatever. That's the way it goes on uh, old school NES games. Get a 
continue to football it here. Which uh, can be kind of a problem because it introduces quite a bit of lag if you're not killing these people, taking them out. If you take them out, you know, clear the screen, so to speak. It does introduce some lag, but uh, nothing I can't deal with. And it's not too bad. I've played a lot worse. I've played uh, Arc Hound. Oh shit. Also known as Contra Force by some folks. Arc Hound there. That game's pretty much like playing in perpetual freaking bullet time. I guess you could say, but uh. You know. Alright, this sucks. This is really freaking. Oh, dude, what the fuck? That's bullshit, dude. I can usually make that, I think. That's like a really, it's just a really tight, specific freaking eight frame window or something. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. That was kind of disappointing. So two deaths, there's no continues, that's pretty much Probably what makes this the most challenging, I suppose. Or not having the freaking grenades at your disposal kind of sucks too. Oh my god! Oh my god, that motherfucker tried to be a fucking hero. Got an American sniper here. Oh, oh shit, that guy's. Bullets better disappear. Alright, cool. Oops. Kind of tight. But, uh, yeah. Boss like that, you can take out with your regular gun, so no freaking grenades needed. I suppose it's kind of a weird because you can only shoot forward with your regular gun, but with your uh, rockets, that's the, that's kind of like your all directions weapon. But uh, once you get used to it, it's not too bad. Uh, this kind of sucks. These freaking these fucking weapons here. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah, fucking yeah! Okie doked it. Okay, I think I'm going right. Going right. Going right. Landmines and fucking boulders. Very patriotic soundtrack. Yeah, I often hear this game get uh, kind of stereotyped, or that's not really the right word, but commonly get pigeonholed as a moods contra. In a jeep. Oh my god! And uh, yeah, pretty much. That's not a bad thing. Oh, shit, shit, shit. I'm gonna take you out just for being a fucking prick. No, I'm not. Football it. Footballing it. Oh shit! But yeah, like I was saying, I mean, it sucks I haven't really just sat down and beaten this game. Like in a serious kind of manner, because it, uh, you know, top 25 game, top 20 list for me personally, I would definitely put Jackal on there. I've always had a, a lot of respect for it. Oh shit. Oh shit. Get that tank. Uh, this helicopter, I know, you have to uh, grenade. Which uh, makes sense. You gotta do the aerial, aerial thing. motherfuckers so they don't gang up on me. Oh shit. Oh shit! That was kinda kinda close. Nice. Alright. Now the bosses in this game are pretty uh pretty friendly. It's a Konami game though. Shit starts getting real fucking Probably about now. Oh, 
shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck. What was I doing? That sucks. Yeah, I better stop footballing it and start relaxing here. Not relaxing, but taking my time. Yeah, a lot of barriers, a lot of walls are starting to pop up. Uh, this looks like a, yeah, this is a definite death trap here. I can't see anyone getting past that without using grenades. I'd almost like to make an exception to the rule for this part, but, uh, I don't know, maybe I can pull some Superman 1 in a 100 chance and get past this without dying. But I don't see it happening, so I'm just going to have a man up and take it. Yep, yeah, there's no freaking way. That's that's one of those things that it's fucking impossible. Fucking impossible! Oh my god! Oh, I got stuck. Yeah, you can't. Oh, I almost did the impossible, dude. Ah, oh, but I didn't. So, meh. Damn, that was crazy. I mean, seriously. If you can get past that part without dying, I'll give you a fucking prize. another path over the other way, but just take what's in front of me here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I don't know why I'm hanging around. You can't kill any of those motherfuckers unless you throw grenades at them, so why am I hanging around? That's a good question. Oh, my God. Fucking one life left. That's fucking shitty. It's fucking shitty, shitty. Bang, bang. Ah! Oh! All right, this is a grenade uh, boss thing for sure. Oops. Cause uh, yeah, you have to. Uh... Well, I guess you can take these fuckers out. That's grenades only for sure. Uh, you can take out these tanks, but you have to blow up their. Uh thingy that they're coming from and I'm almost a hundred percent sure that the only way to do that is with grenades so see I mean I'm not trying to kill that tank but I don't know if you want to disqualify me for that fucking be my guest but if I can sur I'm trying to survive here so yeah but to take these fucking things out here Gotta blow them up when they open. See, like that. And that takes a grenade, so I think. I think that's okay to, uh. You know what I'm saying? Because you do have to take these out with a grenade, and. It's kind of a weird timing. I'm actually not really sure. Yeah, so. Oh, I just sat there and took a fucking bullet. Alright, I. I'm, I was kind of being cautious, like, ooh, let's try not to have fun. Oh, you gotta be facing it, of course. God damn it. Oh, shit. There, no. There you go. Alright. Okay, I see how that works. I don't know if you have to take out everything. Oh, that's definitely a grenade thing. longer I can take this shit. Come on. No. See, I don't understand the timing on this. 
I feel kind of like I'm cheating, but it's like, you gotta, you gotta use grenades on these things. So, I don't know what else to say. I guess I gotta time it. Right when it opens? I'm kind of confused, to be honest. There you go. Yeah. Alright, that should do it. Alright. So, I don't know. I mean, that part felt a little like I was bending the rules, but... I don't know what else to do. It's definitely a grenade... Uh, type of boss. And to kill these guys, you need grenades, so I think that's okay, or... I don't know. I'm kind of... I don't know. I don't freaking know. Um... If I can't get an extra life, I think I'm screwed here. So... I don't even know if I should even give that an attempt. Yeah, fuck it. Let's give it my all. Let's give it a freaking... Whatchamacallit. The last or, uh... Let's, let's go out fighting. Let's go out fighting. Fuck you guys. I like games with impending doom anyway. So let's go out, take it out. So I'm fuck this game. Okay. I know you can't redeem these guys for points until you take them to their. Oh shit, I got an extra life. There's no way I'm gonna get two extra lives. Alright, I think I'm going back to football in it. This is a good end. No trap when I see one. Oh, you fucking motherfucking prick. Alright, 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 alright. Things are getting a little crazy here. Um. Oh, I don't know why I'm going over there and trying to take out those motherfuckers. Are you nuts? Are you nuts? If I was drinking, I'd probably save all these mofuckers. Mofuckers. What? Did you see that? Oh, I do have an extra life, though. What the heck, dude? That wasn't even fair, dude. That's supposed to be a safety spot. What the heck? Because earlier when I was playing this game, just to get we we acquainted with it, um, I was pretty much saving everyone, killing everyone, you know. Um, oh my god! 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 So that was fucked up. That was like that was that was fucked up. That's like. Uh, Bad warfare right there. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? What's going on here? Ah! I got that extra life, but jeez, that was cheap. That was some fucking cheap shit, dude. I do not approve of that. That's dirty warfare right there. Those bastards. Those fucking pricks. Oh! I know where we're at war with these fucking assholes. Son of a bitches, that's why. Can't shoot through the freaking XE things. But they can, okay. Cheaters. See, I don't know if I should kill those guys in the turrets or not. That takes grenades, but... Whatever. Ah. Oh! Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> I saw that one coming for me. Okay, well, um... That was the uh, Jeep Jackoff challenge. It was a fun challenge. Thanks for coming up with it, Emmett. It was a great excuse to put in Jackal, a classic game that I haven't shown any love to in a long time. Again, uh, that might be as far as I've gotten in this game ever. Really. Um, so, uh, on that last boss on the red stage there, kind of started using grenades because I had to, but I was killing... So I don't know if that's up, what's up with that. Um, so, I'll just say... Whatever. But uh, check out Emmons' video. I'll give you a link in the description. Uh, 
if you were confused about the rules or anything. But uh, yeah, great challenge, community challenge, so if anyone wants to try Jackal, give it a shot. Uh, pretty straightforward. I like these straightforward challenges, it's not like they, they gave the game a little more challenge. Obviously no continues and stuff, but uh, it doesn't change the game so much, it's not fun type of thing. You know, so that's cool. Uh, I'm rambling, it's fucking 7.49 in the morning. So, uh, not much to say. Alright, thanks for watching this episode of Playing With The Dick. Another Emmett Rum With A View challenge for Jackal here. Um, I think it's episode 8 or 9 of uh, Playing With The Dick. I'm not really sure. But, uh, yeah, stay tuned for, uh, for more shit sometime when I make shit, I guess. But, uh, yeah, cool.